What's going on guys, it's your boy J-Ho bringing you a brand new video and today is Friday which means Zer is back for the weekend. So uh, we're back at the tower and Zer is in this hangar area once again. So let's see what he has for this weekend on week number 40 I believe. So here's his inventory for the weekend, another disappointing weekend because he's not selling any new House of Wolves exotics. So let's get straight into it for the Titan. We have the MK44 stand aside boots or leg armor. And this one has carry more ammo for heavy weapons and increase the duration shoulder charge remains active. And it's an okay boot. Um, it's pretty fun if you like using so shoulder charge a lot on your Titan. But there are better Titan exotics to use than this. For the Hunter we have the Mask of the Third Man Helmet. And the special perk on this one has Arc Blade attacks use less super energy. Really good helmet. I like using it on my Blade Dancer quite often. It's really good for a lot of scenarios. It also has the replenish health when you pick up an orb. And increased melee attack speed which is pretty decent in certain scenarios as well. I recommend this one 100% if you do not have it. For the Warlock we have the Light Beyond Nemesis helmet. This one special perk is revive teammates faster and spawn more orbs. It also has this, the same other perks that the Mask of Third Man has being replenish health when you pick up an orb and also increase melee attack speed. Another really good helmet, really good especially because a lot of the game modes in House of Wolves are all three man game modes that involve reviving your teammates a lot so I recommend this one. If you don't have it yet for your Warlock, it's really helpful in Trials, in Prison of Elders if you need to revive your teammates, in Strikes, in Skirmish, in all the 3v3 game modes. And then for the gun of the week or the weapon, we have the Universal Remote Primary Shotgun. This one has range and precision damage, increases greatly while aiming down the sights. And it also has crowd control and it kills with this weapon and grant bonus damage for a short time. Pretty decent shotgun, not the greatest exotic to use in your exotic slot, but pretty fun to use if you like using shotguns a lot, so yeah. And then we have the exotic engram being the uh, chest piece once again if you want to gamble. The only new one is the warlock one, the purifier robe, so if you want to try to get it. If you didn't get it last week, I believe this was the same engram he was selling last week. So that's about it for this video. Thank you guys for watching. As always, like, comment, subscribe. Stay tuned for more videos, and I will catch you guys in the next one. Peace.